sponsored by your Oklahoma Ford dealers. I'm damn sure ain't all Mike's fault. You know, it's it's my fault. It's every coach in that room's fault. It's every player in that room's fault. You know, we, we all own it. Lincoln Riley tonight in Norman. Sooners parting ways with defensive coordinator Mike Stoops. 48 points allowed in that loss to Texas. The last straw. And welcome into sports, everybody. Barry Switzer called it feeding the monster. OU football fans demand excellence always, and especially against Texas. Even the legendary last name Stoops, not enough to save the job of a coordinator whose defenses fell far short of excellence for quite some time now. Jacob Toby was in Norman tonight as Riley explained the toughest decision of his young coaching career. Yeah, thanks, Ken. Lincoln Riley met with the media today around 5.30 right behind me in the Everest Training Center to talk about the dismissal of his defensive coordinator, Mike Stoops. But I think there was just enough that I saw as far as the direction that we just needed a spark. And I don't know that there was any one stat or one thing or any single thing that happened. It's not really that dramatic. I think just for me, it was a gut feel. And our job is to we look at the results, but also can we do better? And I thought, you know, that this would have a chance to make us a little bit better right now. Get... We've had a great relationship. He's a great friend, and it was one of the toughest things I've ever had to do. We fought all the way forward. There were also some reports that surfaced earlier today that something happened during halftime of the Cotton Bowl in the locker room. It was said that Curtis Bolton was visibly upset. Lincoln Riley talked about what happened with him in that locker room. I think after half, just just emotional and had to. Sometimes guys get emotional and have to just remove themselves from the situation a little bit. You know, Curtis has been a warrior for us all year. Um, he's one of our emotional leaders, no question. Wears his heart on his sleeve. So for the remainder of this season, it will be Ruffin McNeil to take the place as a defensive coordinator. He'll have a week to get prepared as the Sooners don't play until October 20th when they go out to face TCU. Reporting here in Norman, Jacob Toby, two works for you. Jacob, thank you. McNeil, former defensive coordinator at Texas Tech in 2008 and 2009, coaching veteran. Analyst Bob Diaco, former defensive coordinator at Nebraska Notre Dame, promoted from analyst to outside linebackers coach. More on Mike Stoops now. Tweeting this message today, quote, my family and I continue to hold the University of Oklahoma in the highest regard. We wish nothing but continued success for the program. I've been very fortunate to contribute to many successes while at Oklahoma. I will forever be grateful for these opportunities and memories. Some of those successes. 12 years as OU's defensive coordinator, six Big 12 titles, one national title, nine seasons of 10 wins or more.